we're off. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Actually, I've got to say, those clouds look scarily unfriendly. And um, yes, it's daylight. Look, my God, it's daylight. And I'm talking to you guys. Yay! I will admit, I actually did this video this morning. But um, number one, I made a cock up. And number two, I've left work early. And I'm doing it in the daylight, so I thought, ah, oh, sod it, I'll redo it again. So there we go. Hey, hey. Oh, so you can see what's going on, because it's daylight, not night time. Daylight, night time. Daytime, night time. Never mind. Um, <coughs> so, what did I talk about this morning? Well, it's quite simple. Number one, uh, hang on, I forgot something. Yes, don't forget if you like my videos, give them a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to turn your notifications and you can leave comments in the comment section below. So why am I so excited today? Well, it's quite simple that I actually yesterday managed to work out how to goal set. Something that I've struggled with all my bloody life. And um, yesterday, it kind of, the last jigsaw piece fell to pee, fell in place. And lo and behold, I was like, oh, so that's how you goal set. So yeah, so, um, and that was courtesy of a book I've been reading called The Slight Edge by Jeff Olson. And uh, basically, it was from the first chapter as well. It was just the first chapter. Something come from there, which was kind of like the final piece. Now, here's the strange thing is, is that I can't remember how not to goal set now, bearing in mind that I've just learned how to goal set. So I can't remember. Before, I didn't understand it. It was just like real gobbledygook and completely foreign to me. It was just like, what? Hey? What? Huh? So, um, yeah. So, for example, so what... I did was is that it's I've got to lose weight there's no two ways about it I am a fat bastard I am I'm just I am I'm according to my BMI I am clinically obese times three so yeah so that's how bad I am I am a I'm 111 kilos and only 165 centimeters tall and that's five foot five five foot six depending on what money you work with and depending on what time of day it is so don't ask me to convert the kilos because I don't have a clue so anyway um, when I was reading this book in the first chapter, it basically explains something, which is when you go, um, when you kind of hit rock bottom, when you kind of get to somewhere and you're like, oh, for God's sake, I don't want to be like this anymore, blah, 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 blah. You go from what he was classifying as from failure to survival. So basically, um, you kind of drag yourself out of, um, the failure side. Hang on, I've got... I think I've got the dead cats in my mouth. That's better. Um, so you basically, you do uh, obviously load of steps to get you from where you were to what he calls the survival area. So from failure to survival. But what we don't realize is that if we continue doing those steps, we will go from survival to success. But we tend to forget, we tend to stop, which is something I'd do. So I'd lose, you know, I'd be like, oh God, I've got to lose weight. Oh, you know, I'm just, I'm not well with it, I need to do this, it's not doing me as really good, blah, 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 blah. So then I'll lose um, three or four kilos, if not more. I think the lowest I've got to just recently is 106. So you imagine that. So, uh, but then I'll stop doing what I did to get to that 106 and just go into kind of survival mode. And then next thing you know, I'm 111 kilos. And I'm like, what? So yeah, it's just basically, so what he says is, if you keep repeating those steps that you did to get you there, then obviously that will then help you get to wherever you want to go. So for me, obviously, it's losing weight. So um, rather than stopping, it's continuing. So for me, it's a daily thing. So every day I know that I have a budget. I think it's 2,240 calories or something, something like that. So I need to uh, keep with inside that budget. And today I've measured my steps. And according to my phone, I walked 9,288 steps. Which, believe it or not, means I burnt 297 calories, which can add to my deficit. 
so that's fine that's good so basically if i stay below my or well, within my budget so less than 2240 calories i should in theory lose weight and it's true because i have done that i've, I've done that before in the past and i have actually lost weight so um so yeah so my goal at the moment is so uh if my long-term goal is basically losing weight then my short-term goals are in fact the the calorie counting so making sure that i don't go above my daily budget in relation to calorie counting so there we go so it's like whoa it's just as simple as that I was like, wow, that is so simple. So whether that will work with things like YouTube or not, I don't know. I've yet to try that out. So obviously, because YouTube have changed the goalposts slightly and everybody's going, oh, oh no, everybody's changed the goalposts. And I'm going, yay, they've changed the goalposts because it now means I can do this instead of that. I just can't be honest with you. I've got 840 subscribers, um, nearly a hundred thousand views i think i've got nearly a hundred thousand views i might even be a hundred thousand views i'm not quite sure um i'm not quite sure on the hours wise so like i'm i'm not it's not that i'm making money from youtube or not at the moment if if anything it's like dribs and drabs it's really pence it's it's pittance um so at the end of the day it's not really going to affect me at all Although somebody's going, oh no, YouTuber favouring the large YouTuber and not the small YouTuber. Well then, basically what you have to do is, you have to do everything that takes you from... So everything that you did to get 100 subscribers, because at the end of the day, getting 100 subscribers, I think, is a damn sight harder than getting 1,000 subscribers. Because um, I'm, you know, I'm 840 and I'm, I'm getting there. So it's just a base of, basically do what I did to get in fact to do what I did to get 840 subscribers I just keep doing it and the more I do it the better it is oh I'm in the wrong lane I wanted to go down there no mind I uh, wonder what the weather's like oh I'll carry on that's fine anyway I, I, I hope you understand this video I hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget as I say give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to turn on notifications leave all comments in the comment section below and let me know what you think to my new task cam um, with the audio and i shall catch you on the next video so cheerio and goodbye for now Arrivederci. still don't know what that means <laughs> <laughs>